like a mouse. Is that a mouse? It's a mouse. I see it. There's a mouse in there. Hunter. Hunter, he works for What's Inside and he does a lot of our social media stuff. There's a mouse inside of that outlet right there. Reach in and open the metal thing. Okay, open it up. Don't hurt. Don't let it get you. It went that one right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is oh it? my gosh, it's fat. What is it? You see it? There it is. There's the mouse. Oh man. Ah, there it goes. Well, what's going up there? Oh, it went up there. It went up in that right there. This little creep. <laughs> it's been kind of a long day. <laughs> I love that we just found a mouse. So, to explain a little bit. Today started at 6 a.m. Good morning, it's 5.30 in the morning. In St. George, Utah, about a mile away from the Arizona border. And today is gonna be a travel day. No Lincoln, Leslie, no Claire, no London. I miss them already. And I'm only like 20 miles away from where I left them this morning. I'm gonna miss my flight. I drove to the airport. This is one of the smallest airports I've ever been to. You know you're in Utah when you find a vending machine that is full of ice cream. Flew to Salt Lake. All right, we made it to Salt Lake City. And how's this phone looking? It's a little shaky. I went to get off the plane. My backpack was gone. Some guy took my bag off the plane. I had to chase him down and get my backpack. Somebody took it. So it was this cool guy up in front of us. He accidentally just grabbed mine and luckily found him. Didn't take too long. Then we took a four and a half hour flight to Boston. All right, made it to Boston and that's where we're at right now. Now the conference hooked us up with free flights. Free flights from this airline called Azori or something. Azores, Azores, is that what it is? How do you say it in Spanish? Azores. That's it, Azores. Sores, free flights, which is super nice. But you've always heard the saying, like you get what you pay for. We're here three hours before the flight. There's not one person at the stand. There's just all these people waiting to check in and check their bags. We read the reviews of the, this airline and they're awful. Casey Neistat always does these reviews of like, hey, the $20,000 airplane seat. Well, we're gonna show you what a free airplane seat looks like when you're flying across the entire stinking ocean to go to Portugal. We're going on this super strange plane. Awesome. Thank you, goodbye. You're welcome, you're welcome, goodbye. What? This camera? It's very unique. It is unique. I mean, you can get it at Best Buy, but it looks fancy with this on the top. Yeah, that's, what, that's what I was going to say. <laughs> it just picks up the audio better. No problem. Enjoy, so, yeah. okay? Thanks a lot. International travel is always interesting. I forgot so many things. I didn't bring an adapter. I didn't bring lots of stuff. I got lots of surprise treats that Hunter doesn't know about yet. I'll just tell you now. One of them is beef jerky. Pepper, peppered beef jerky. And candy. And dried mangoes. And something else. Healthy. Fix it yet? Yes. All right, we made it on the plane. The uh, pilots have uh, maintenance in there and they have a flashlight and they're like looking at all the sensors. Something's broken in there. No way. Yeah, I started to film it and then they told me, go, oh, stop, stop, stop filming. Look at that screen right there. It's like straight out of the 80s. <laughs> We're in the back of the airplane. We've been told to not film many times. Um, I don't know how Casey does it. How does he film all these videos on planes when supposedly you're not supposed to film? But they did finally agree that I could film myself and my squeaky chair. <laughs> the other funny thing is I keep getting glares like all of the flight attendants have spoken to each other already and they all are keeping an eye on me. So, I mean, it makes sense if the reviews are not great for this airline. They don't want people to film stuff, so. Back of the plane. She said I could film myself. Only yourself. Only myself. Only Look, okay. it's on me. Thank you. They're very, very strict about um, filming in here. Here's what we got going on for the playground. If I take the water bottle out. Yeah. Okay, um, six hours. 
we will see if there's anything else interesting on this flight. We have a very loud buzzing noise going on. Do you hear it? Lights don't work. We're not even moving. What the heck is that? If you're watching this video, it means that we made it. That's not that comforting to me right now. this is. I don't know where we are. So I think it's like Azures or something. That's all we know. We didn't have to do any paperwork. We went in a different area than everybody else. I'm like wondering do I pull all this door or not. It says welcome. But then it won't move. Alright we're in this cage. I think this is our home. It really is. There's nowhere else to go. Birds birds in here. Those birds? Well, we had a one hour layover in this beautiful island of Azores. I took the time to look online to see what this place is even about. Turns out it is freaking gorgeous. They called it basically heaven on earth. Why am I only here for an hour? And why am I only hearing about this place right now? Now we get on the plane, we're heading to Lisbon and it's gonna be 10.30 in the morning there. And we probably have slept maybe an hour, two hours total. So uh, jet lag will be for real, but we're not gonna waste any time. We're gonna see the whole city and have fun. <laughs> Lisbon, Portugal. It's a little bit windy out here. A little chilly, but nice and sunny. The ocean looks beautiful coming in with old castles and different things near the water. I slept a total of probably two hours in the last 24 hours. So on par with the rest of this week. That is my fourth airplane today in exactly 24 hour time frame. We had a few layovers, but that's a lot. It's been a long day. Look at this moving walkway. It goes downhill. Okay, let go. <laughs> that was awesome. That worked out way better than I thought it would. So BMW is the sponsor of this event and they just have all types of BMWs everywhere. Very nice car. Hello. Hello. Hey. Are you from here? Yeah. How many languages do you speak? Two, just two. Portuguese and English. placed directly in the middle of Lisbon, which is completely authentic. No hotels around here. That's the great thing about Airbnbs. You can just stay in a place like this. Look at that street. Look down the street. Same thing here. I just keep filming the streets because they're so pretty. Look at the road. This place is cool. All right, we've just been wandering around the city. It's gorgeous. Um, I'm kind of hungry. It's two o'clock. Back home, it's probably like nine or 10 in the morning. We should probably eat something and then go to bed. There's a little cafe right here. Check this out. Yeah. We got toasted ham and cheese. 
I know, it's kind of like an American thing, but it's good. This is like my comfort food until it's time to go to bed. Food acquired. We just looked at the schedule. I'm with on a panel with a couple other people, Jenna Marbles. She's a YouTuber, a guy that's in charge of Amazon Influencer Program, and then the CEO of Streamies. So there's the four of us, and we have 20 minutes total. So flew all the way out here. We're gonna be here for four days for a 20 minute talk. That's pretty cool. Look at this door handle. This is our place. Look at this. <laughs> we made it. We're going up the steps. I think we're going up the third level right now. There's a bed, couch, kitchen. This is the view. You can see the river, the ocean right there. I don't know what to say. I wish Leslie was here. <laughs> okay, I'm walking around the entire house here. Down there. I want a kid up there. They're a little shaky, I'll be honest. I'm uh, not too confident about, about climbing up there. I think I'm gonna pass on that for now. <laughs> All right, I don't even know. I can't even show you how beautiful this place is on camera. I just don't think it does it justice. So it is time. I'm super exhausted. It's really excited to be here. It's three o'clock in the afternoon. I haven't slept for over 24 hours. I know I'm gonna wake up super, super early, but I think it's the right thing to do to go to bed. So I hope you enjoyed seeing my travels here. Sorry if it wasn't that eventful. I mean, there was a mouse. There's a mouse in the airport. That's something. But. I'm here in Lisbon. Um, the next few days I'll show you what's going on. A lot of it is conferences, really good things about social media marketing and different things. Um, but I definitely want to go around and see the city. There's castles and all kinds of stuff here. So get ready for a few vlogs on the trip. Thanks for watching, guys.